We're rolling. Oh, goodness. In three, two, no, we're already rolling, so. Oh, goodness. Okay, wait. You have to give it a second so that I have time to, like, cut it, you know? So we have to be silent for, like, a second. I can't do that. Are you joking? Okay. Remember how we don't edit? No, I'm gonna edit. Oh, but we like to have raw yeah. film. Oh. Dirty pop. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Emily Jean Pledge Yes, it's gonna be so awesome. I'm so excited. Well, that's embarrassing. Anyway, this is this is the second of our how-to series. Yes, and today we're gonna teach you how to wash out that dirty mouth without the soap. Yes. You know. So do you ever, ever do you ever have those times where you're just like, oh man, the beep, and then you just say yeah, whatever. it's like bleep, 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 and you're just like, well, I mean, of course, those sounds aren't actually coming. She has those um, moments sometimes. Yeah, sometimes um, I do. I do have those moments, but so, everyone does. We all deal with this. Yes, and that is why we thought that this would be such a great topic um, to discuss today. Well, instead of using the F word, or the D word, or the B word, or the C word, or the A word. There are a lot of those words, or it's a letter word. Um, we came up with some good ones. Um, actually, I borrowed one from SpongeBob. I watched that as a kid. Who didn't? Yeah. I, everyone watched SpongeBob. It's a great show. Yeah. So we were thinking, like, instead, oh, also another one. This isn't really a so much a curse word, unless um, you're one of those religious people um, out there. But, oh my god, that is a bad phrase, my that friends. Especially bad right phrase. now during the time of Lent. Oh, yeah. It's almost Easter, you shouldn't be saying things like that. Well, you shouldn't just be saying, I mean, one of the Ten Commandments is, uh, don't, I don't remember it. Don't use God's name in vain. Oh, there you go. And so, um, she didn't even go to a private school, I didn't, I don't remember that. Yeah, so, uh, public school all the way know more about God than those uh, Lutheran kids. So, <laughs> yes. um, but anyway, so instead of saying, oh my God, say, oh my goodness, or oh my word. That's how my Latin teacher talks. Oh my word, y'all. So that's a good one. No, um, it's just harmless words like man and golly and that SpongeBob word, barnacles. Yep. That, there's that SpongeBob word. Barnacles. And, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. And, um, Instead of, like I said, instead of using the F bomb, like we're not going to drop emphasis. any of those. For emphasis. Yeah, this is, now we're talking about emphasis because there are the people that are saying, oh my goodness, this is so effing sweet. And you're just like, whoa, 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 whoa. Completely cool it. unnecessary. Yeah, it, it wasn't. Or like, oh my gosh, tomorrow morning I have to get up at effing six o'clock in the morning. You don't need to use the no. F word. You don't, it's I mean, so if you want to emphasize something. Instead of dropping the F bomb, drop Emily, the what would stink we say? bomb. The stink bomb. That's right. So instead of saying F this or like this is so effing cool, you're going to say it was so stinking cool. Exactly. And uh, I think that's just about it yeah, for you guys today. That's, that's all we've got. Yeah. But uh, so you guys have been stinking awesome and we hope that you have a great rest of your days. I'll go turn it off. Okay, I've really <laughs> got it this time. <laughs> Bye!